Yo, what's up guys? There's a brand new event on Roblox called the Songbreaker Awards. It's an event that Roblox is doing with Logitech and there's going to be a bunch of new items that are coming out. There's a few different hats that are coming out. You have this key hat, you have this camera stream cam hat, you have this Yeti microphone hat, and you have this light back hat. Plus there's also a bunch of different headphones that you can actually get, which I think actually look pretty cool. And they even have some new layered clothing that you can get, some hoodies over here that are also pretty nice. Plus some t-shirts with the Songbreaker Awards logo on it. But the important thing is these hats over here. There's a total of five new hats that they actually released. They have the Pop Keys hat, the Pop Keys confetti, the Logitech stream cam, the Logitech Lytra glow wingsuit, and the Blue Yeti shoulder microphone. What's interesting about these items is in the description of all of them, them, they say limited time in the description of all of them it says limited time all five of these items have that same thing in the description and as you guys know for a bunch of these new limited items it actually says limited or collectible in the description for these vans north face goggles it says limited edition right here for the vans checkerboard bucket hat it says this is a collectible item right here for the gucci headband it says this is a collectible item right here as well and for these items it clearly says limited time and then it says it's exclusively available for the duration of the Logitech Songbreaker Awards. So people have been talking about whether or not these items are actually going to end up going limited. Since it has that same thing in the description, people were thinking that maybe it will actually end up going limited because of that. However, sadly, I actually have to disagree. I don't think that these items are going to go limited at all. Because if you look, the items aren't actually made by Roblox. Similar to that last event that we saw, which also said limited, but those items didn't go limited and they weren't made by Roblox either. The items for the Beatland event in the game actually said limited under them. They haven't gone limited and they were confirmed that they're not going to go limited, even though they said limited on them. So honestly, until we see an actual UGC limited item, I wouldn't recommend buying any of these UGC items unless we have something confirmed or if they release another one before. So I wouldn't recommend buying them yet. I really don't think that these Logitech items are going to be the first UGC limited. I think they would have made more of a big deal out of it if they were going to be going limited. So I don't recommend you guys buy these. Personally, I'm not going to buy them and I don't think you guys should either. But be sure to let me know if you guys disagree with me or if you agree with me. Do you guys think that these items actually are going to be going limited? Because I definitely don't think they will. But be sure to let me know what you guys think in the description below. Obviously, I do hope they go limited, but I'm just pretty confident it won't happen. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe. Peace.